Hey, hey, how's it going? I am the Sunrise Gecko, and welcome to Mermaid Swamp, the remake. Now, this is an old, old, I think it's like an RPG horror game from way back when, but someone mentioned it the other day, and I thought, you know, I should play that. So here we go. Oh, yeah, buttons. Okay, let's start with save number one. Sorry about that. Okay. <laughs> Start. Do the same, huh? Works a little better. This is already gonna be great. This is a horror game. It contains scares and grotesque content, so beware. Also, please adhere to the following rules to prevent trouble. No repurposing. Okay. Do not cut the end credits from videos, so you're gonna have to watch the end credits with me. Check the author's site. Okay. Acknowledge the author takes no responsibility for any trouble caused by the use of this software. You were warned. What the? Am I in underwater? What the hell am I doing? Somebody there? Rin. Rin. Oh, you're cute. Rin, wake up. Oh, voice acting. In Japanese. For crying out loud, just get up already. Oh, fine, say throw. Oh, shut up. I was just taking a nap. Not so bad. One hell of a nap. Yuta's been driving all this time, and you've just been snoozing back. Sheesh, not a hint of lady in this one. Ain't gotta be lady like for a punk like you. Rise and shine. Since you started around noon, I'm guessing you slept well? It was a rude awakening with gray hairs here, but sure, I slept well. Like your yammering yammerzaki. Okay. I don't know. I'm sorry if I pronounced any of these wrong. By the way, Yuta, where are we anyway? You said something about kicking it into high gear. Are we in the mountains or what? <laughs> My bad. I don't know where this is either. Well, I'm glad we trust you. You're telling me we're lost? Yep. Don't have the first clue where we are. You're kidding. You said the mountains were a shortcut, so I thought you knew the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kind of know it first, but the fog got so big, so sooner or later. <laughs> that ain't funny, shrink face. This is exactly why I don't want to go on no trip in your rusty old no GPS car. Aw, don't be like that. I said sorry. Well, now what do we do? I don't even see any signs around. Huh? Why did you stop? I don't know, we just stopped moving. Hold on a sec, I'll, I'll test the engine. Yeah, there we go. Ah, crap, that's not good. Sounds like it's totally busted. Are you for real? Oh, you dumbass! Ugh. Wait here, I'll go out and take a look at the car. Oh, we can run around. I'm gonna fix the sound problem. Be right back. Sound problem's still broken, but that's okay. Hey, somebody there? Nope, I fixed it. Do it. Well, mysterious person in the woods. Quite a surprise! What would you be doing up in these mountains, miss? Oh, just an old coot. Freaked the hell right out of me. Right. I was on a trip with my college pals, but our car got went kaput, so we're kind of stuck. Oh, that's very unfortunate. Do you have anywhere you can stay? Nope, nothing. If we can't get it running, I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. It's never fun. Oh, 
that would be most terrible. My home is nearby. By all means, stay there. Even in the summer, it's quite cool at night. For real? Well, let me just talk to my buds. What a relief. Thank you, old man. But you're sure now? We don't want to put any pressure on you. Now, now, I own the land in these parts, you see. My house's size far outstrips my own needs. Ah, that's right. I should introduce myself. My name is Yukio Tsuchida. I'm just a lonely old man living in my own. So some young folks would laven up the house. I'm really grateful. We'll just get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. Uh-huh, sure. This here is my house. Oh, this place is huge. <laughs> That's a pretty huge pond. Artificially made, I bet. Oh no, that's a swamp. The house is built by the nearby swamp. I see a mansion over there too. Is that also your house, Mr. Tsuchida? Indeed. But it's not being used now. I had this one built around the late 80s. Cranberries! Now it's getting chilly, so let's be getting inside. I'll show you to the guest rooms. You may use this room, Miss Rin. I do forgive the mustiness. It ain't nothing. I kinda like the retro style it's got going. Thanks again, Gramps. Say, I'm sure you are all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner. Until then, please make yourself at home. Alright, so I just went ahead and saved because I could not fix the thing I wanted to fix. I was hoping I could turn off the voices. That's okay. Well, we'll get through it. Alright. So, huh? A large dresser. The luggage is in here. A desk. The desk lamp has an outlet on it. Very informative. Trash can. Good, important stuff. Can't look at the chair. Okay. A fireplace. Riveting. Oh! <gasps> Bedtime. Sleep. No. Oh. Ooh, we're in the cell phone. Charger. Oh, okay. Ooh, can we charge the phone real quick? Bum bum bum. Ah, wrong button. Oh, guess not. Okay. Well, let's go explore. Ooh. Ah. Hey Rin, you'd better not be rude to Mr. Suit. Tsuchida. We're indebted to him for the day. Uh, what do you mean rude? I mean, don't go calling him an old coot, and don't make demands almost for dinner. Well, maybe that's not that impudent. Uh, yeah. Okay. All the rooms look pretty much the same. Let's check out the other. see how the other people are doing. Hey, have you seen the paintings in the hall? No, haven't yet. You should look later. There's some really pretty pictures of ladies. Oh, gotcha. I'll take a gander. Yeah, no, paintings and horror games, not not good. Not good. Hey, listen, Rin. Isn't that swamp outside the house the hugest? I went out to look earlier. It's really pretty. Oh, really? That thing was kind of goopy and filthy. Not at all, man. Look, later, okay? I might ask if we can go swimming tomorrow. Well, don't you come near me after that. You're gonna reek. I'm starting to like Rin. Oh, wait, no, there's a... Oh, where does this go? Oh, this is nice. Shelves. More shelves. Ooh, what's this? Oh, that's, um... Oh, God, that... That's from an old mermaid corpse hose hoax from the mermaid corpse hoax English is my first language <laughs> oh the hell's this creepy I'm 
going to agree with you, but uh, you know, you, you're, ooh, I'm gonna go, I'll come back later. I think that progresses the story and I will explore a little more. Ooh, dining room. Ooh, more paintings. Well, now that one is pretty. Yeah. Lady drowning, always a beautiful picture. Nope, 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 get out of there. A bucket. Oh, it's a trash can. I was excited. I wanted it to be a bucket. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. A flower adorns the cabinet. I thought it said a <laughs> flower with horns. Nope, go away. Nope. Old man. You're going to kill us, or you're going to be related to our dads. Dead mermaid. Very beautifully done, though. Ooh, bathroom. Yay. Bathroom sink. Washing machine, very nice. That was a sound. Body soap and shampoo. Bath stool, very nice. Wash basin. Huge bathtub. Yeah, I, I like that bathtub. <laughs> was that a moan? I'm pretty sure I heard moan. What's this? Oh, okay. All right. Oh, locked, of course. How about this one? Oh, regular old bathroom, like a half bath. Cool. Toilet paper, very good. I'm glad you have that. Ooh, the living room, ashtray. So I'm guessing Mr. Suchida, Suchida, spokes. A phone, good. We can call for nobody. TV on top of the rack, there's a DVD player and more. Okay. I was... Oh, okay. Learning secrets of the house. Not really. Not really secrets. Oh, okay. Let's check out this painting. That one's actually... I mean, the colors and the posture and stuff tell me it should be peaceful, but there's something about this one that I don't like. I don't know, maybe... I don't know, I think drowning with that one, I, I don't like it. I'm gonna go ahead and save since I've already got this open. Yep, sweet. Cool. Alright. Yep, we just came out of there, so... Now let's... Ah, stairs. Stairs. Probably shouldn't go upstairs without asking. Oh. How about the door? Front door? Ooh. Whoa, that's one big swamp. Can't even see on the other side through this fog. Hmm? Ooh, I can't read that. What's this? A stone monument? Uh, a man did abduct upon the seashore. Crap, I can't read this. Maybe Satoro would know about this old stuff. He's got more knowledge than he knows what to do with. Satoro, we are dragging you out here. Curious about the monument? Oh, the old man. You really gotta not do that. Oh, my apologies. So, have you read the inscription here? I couldn't make heads or tails of it. What's it say? It's a legend that's told around here. The legend of the so-called Mermaid Swamp. Legend? Mermaid Swamp? It originated in the middle of the Meiji era. My family has governed this area since around that time. Or rather, we simply owned the mountains. It is said the son of a leader descended the mountains down to the seaside and found a mermaid. Uh-huh. Sounds kind of shady right out of the gate. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> well, it is a legend. The man was so smitten with the mermaid's beauty that he took her to his mountain home. He created a fish tank just for her and had her live within, and he filled it with water from this very swamp. But a mermaid of the sea cares not for swamp water. The mermaid grew weak and became quite ugly. Her clear skin swelled, her scales fell off, 
her voice as Melodica's ringing bells was reduced to a beastly howl. The mermaid soon took on a most repulsive form and subsequently died. A mermaid's wrath is surely no petty thing. Young women vanished from the nearby village. People call that the mermaid's curse. Yeah, sounds fair. As such, this monument was put up to mourn her. What do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting nonetheless. Yes. Yeah, I'd say it's pretty interesting. A little sad, since humans tend to want to ruin everything that we touch, but whatever. Oh, so sorry. I, I don't know about all that. Cetra likes stories and stuff, so he might get it more. How old are you, Rin? Oh, that is right. Ah, yes, I've prepared dinner now, so come to the dining room if you would. Oh, finally! Okay, let's get a move on. Yeah, so, food motivated. I can relate. Not as much as some others, but I can relate. Delish! This is some great stuff, old man. I'm glad you like it. Take it slow and eat up. Ah, and the bath is free if anyone wants to use it. The giant bathtub. Yes, I like, I like baths. You must be tired from the day's events. Please, rest yourselves. See you. Yuka, aren't you gonna eat? What's up? Yeah, I guess I'm just too tired to have an appetite. Are you okay? We'll do the cleanup. You can get some rest. Alright. Thanks, Yuta. Well, that's nice of them to clean up after he was nice enough to fix dinner for him. <laughs> yummy, yummy! Okay, y'all clean up now. The Rin? Why do we have to clean up after you? Do it yourself, yummy yucky. Yeah, Saitra, I'm agreeing with you here. It's really not that hard. Man, I'm stuffed. Can't be bothered to bathe. I'm ready to conk out. Nope, nope, bathe. You, you need bath. Bath. I forgot how to get to the bath. We're gonna find it, though. I am... Ah, no, not that way. This is gonna be trouble if I have to run away from anything. Uh, is this it? Yeah! Bath! Bath time! Oh, no bath. Oh, dang it. <sighs> Much disappointment. Camera did something weird. Okay. Oh, well, I guess we'll go to bed. Sleepy, sleepy. Ooh, dream time. Huh? Am I underwater again? Must be a dream. I'm not drowning, and my eyes don't hurt. Can't move a muscle, though, and it's really cold. Ooh, a shadow. Somebody's there again. Who the hell is it? Why are you staring at me? I'll kill you. <laughs> yeah, sure. Empty threats. Is it morning? Man, that was a strange dream. Alright, I'm out of bed. Yeah, save real quick, because I don't know. I don't know what the rules are. Yeah, save over there. Why? Because I can. Alright, let's go check out our friend. Uh, Rin? No, oh, not Rin. I'm Rin. Uh, Yuka? Ooh, she does not look good. Oh, Yuka, it's morning, you know. You ready to get up? Sorry, Ben. I've kind of got the chills. Is it okay if I rest a little longer? I got you. Are you okay, though? Don't overdo it. Yeah, I'm fine. It's really foggy out, so maybe I've got a cold. 
Yeah, I'm worried. We're very much worried about her. So, Seitro and Yuka are gone. Ote? Oh, here we go. Ah, you guys are up early. What are you up to? As if it's actually early, it's already dead. But anyway, I checked in the car earlier, and it's still totally busted. Couldn't we be out of gas? It's so old, I wouldn't have allowed it just falling apart. But whatever it is, how are we gonna leave? Good morning, everyone! What's happening here? So that's the story, old man. Real sorry, but can we stay a while longer? I want to see if we can't fix the car. I don't mind at all, but as it happens, I have to go out for a few days. Ah, uh, convenient. To the nearby village, on some business. I must be leaving around evening. I'll probably come back to your dead corpses. Ha ha ha! Is that right? Well, we'll be out soon then. We wouldn't want to stay too long. Even without a car, we should find our way walking. We could leave the car and take a train home if need be. At any rate, we just gotta go down the mountain. No, it's quite alright for you to stay. I'm the only one who lives here after all. And I would quite appreciate someone looking after it. Uh -huh. oh, really? Indeed. Besides, you won't get far walking in the mountains. Certainly not in this fog. You might die somewhere other than this house. You're more than welcome to stay until your car is fixed. Just please don't do anything dangerous like walking around the mountains. Alright, thanks, Gramps. Well, I'm suspicious. Well then, I've got to be heading out. Keep a close eye on any flames. And again, the mountains are dangerous, so don't. We get it, okay? We'll hold down the fort. Don't worry, old man. Don't go trip and die yourself, you hear? Oh, you're rude. I'll be careful. So long. Oh, hey, it's evening already. Better be the first to use the bath. I'd hate to go in after the guys. This, this, this is true. Oh boy. Oh, nope, that's locked. That's the wrong one. It's this one. Alright, bath time. Oh yeah, that's the good stuff. So busy yesterday, I couldn't get a relaxing bath in. And having a huge one like this is sweet. Yes, I agree, except you're gonna die. I wonder if Yuka's gonna bathe. Sucks that she's not feeling well. Waste of a trip. Getting sleepy. Don't fall asleep in the bath. Mm hmm. Ugh. Boom! What the hell is this? The, the water got all gross. It wasn't this color when I got in, right? Maybe you should have bathed yesterday. <laughs> not my fault, right? I'm not that dirty, right? Well, you know, your attitude. Hey, what's the matter? What the hell are you perching on me for? Okay. For real though, this is like mud. Just how gross is that body of yours? Shut your mouth? That ain't the problem. The water just got all muddy, just like that. Alright, jokes aside then. Isn't that swamp water? Swamp water? Why would that be the bath genius? I don't know, maybe the screw. Yeah, the screwing's plumbed up. Maybe the plumbing screwed up. So it mixed with some swamp water. Though the shower and toilet look okay. So better not bathe for a while, I guess. We'll have to hold out to the old man's back. Okay, I'm out. Well. This is your this is your hint, lady. You need to get your friends and you need to go. Damn it, what even? Ah, this pisses me off. I'll check on Yuka and then go to bed. Sounds sounds like a good idea. Yeah. Get out. 
and nope, it's over here. Okay, every painting's changed. I want to check real quick. Nope, same painting. Okay. Hmm. Wait, no, that's not. That's Sejora's room. This is Yuka's room. Oh, Yuka, you okay? She sounds asleep, but she's shivering. She must be feeling really sick. I gotta make her eat something tomorrow. Maybe take some cold medicine. For sure. You know, as rude as you are, at least you do care about your friends. Let's go. Yeah, that's let's go steep. Go steep. Ugh, I just remembered my phone's dead. Better get it charging. Was there an outlet around here? I tried to do that earlier. Item. Nope. Items. Charger. There we go. Alright, that'll do her. Bedtime. Alright. Learned from Sarah's missing that cell phones freak out in horror games, so let's see what happens. Dream time? I hear water again. Ooh! What? What in the fresh hell? The house is full of water. Right. Just a dream, because I'm not drowning. Boy, what a weird dream. Eh, it's a little strange. Alright. Just in case. Because I'm a paranoid and I think we're going to run into something. Nope. Alright. Get, okay, get out that wrong button. Alright, what's going on? Ooh, ooh, okay, that's not good. Let's follow it. It's the stupidest thing you can do in a horror game. Was there something there? It went towards you because from that's why you could sick. Mermaid's Curse. I've figured this out. No, you leave her alone. Oh. <gasps> Le gasp. Oh, just a dream. What an awful dream, yeah? Yeah. Good grief, yeah, let's get out of bed. All right, well, I am going to call it here for Mermaid Swamp. Eh, let me see real fast. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Wait, no. Hang on. I will figure out these controls. There we go. All right. Huh. But let me know what you guys think down in the comments below, and come on back for probably the next episode of Mermaid Swamp. Until then... Have a good one.